Hey guys, welcome to Rohit FP. Well, today I'm back with the Fly Color 30 amps Opto ESCs. Uh, yeah, so uh, you guys might be uh, might have looked at this ESCs which are in the market. It's supposed to two to four s. Well, I got this from Gearbest.com. You can check the description for links to buy this product. Well, uh, guys, I have I have uh, some detailed specs about this on my website too. Uh, the again the link is in the description. It's www.fpcrazy.net. So you can go over there. You can see the buy link and you can just buy it from there. Well, this is very cheap ESCs. Uh, like cheap as in if you compare it to other ESCs I will be testing them out with a new setup wherein I will be placing uh, I will be using RS2205 uh, motors uh, sorry RS2205S motors which are the respect uh, motors that are out in the market well let's just have a look at the size and the form factor of these ESCs uh, okay so we have a we have a packet over here uh, ESC seems to be normal uh, kind of the size the wires are pretty long so that you can you can do any kind of builds that you want like you can keep them as uh, we have a manual over here you can keep the wires like very short and even the signal wire is too long I suppose and the wires you can see are very long well that's a good thing that you can you can just uh, cut it cut them according to what you want what size you want well this is the ESC that you actually get in the so guys this is the ESC that you get in the packet like this is the ESC that we get well it's written that it's 30 amp ESC supports 2 to 4 as opto ESCs and the form factor is very small you can check uh, you can see that we have about four tantalums five and six six tantalums which can be damaged while you are flying or if you are not using this head string uh, what usually i do is i just cover the arm with a uh, cello tape or electrical tape that we have uh, or a packing tape whatever you can use so that it enforces it uh, i have previous experiences that the little b ESCs had similar kind of stuff which usually got out and it just broke off and i couldn't find it well the mosfets on this ESCs are pretty flat and i don't feel that the uh, like the PCB and the uh, kind of thing it's it's very nice actually it's a good product I don't know about the performance yet because I haven't used them I will be using them in a build and I will just tell it, I will just test it out well uh, everything else is good the PCB thickness is very nice it's kind of thick like one one two mm so yeah so guys the overall uh, overall thing the ESCs are very nice pretty good quality build and so uh, if you want to buy this product you can just visit uh, gearbest.com i am I'm providing a link in the description also we have a manual with the ESCs that they have given uh, this manual basically tells us about how to connect and how to uh, how to calibrate the ESCs and wh what are the loop uh, like loop ratings and the programming parameter values they have given a detailed uh they have given a detailed uh, structure and the value set of the uh, values that you have to put well they have also mentioned the manufacturing model and the current amperage well this model is raptor 30 amps so it get it gives you constant current of 30 amps and burst current of 40 amps so that is very nice well it is it doesn't has a bac obviously because it's an opto esc it's supposed 2 to 4 s and uh, weight in category is 9.6 grams i'm not sure if this is 9.6 grams because i didn't feel that much in my hand obviously you won't feel it in your hand so yeah and so the frame factor uh, the support that it supports is 170 to 450 on a multi-rotor that is it's written on there so yeah pretty much good uh, you can also put them on 130 i think i guess because the size is so small uh, i have used little piece on 130 so it doesn't matter as well uh, again the there are some values uh, these are not the values these are the bip, bip and uh, like the beeping sequence and stuff given over here so it shows you how much uh, what are the bip sequences when you calibrate and when you enter the programming mode and how you program the ESC so this is a very nice document given for all the four ESCs uh, I guess this is a pretty good ESC at least for the documentation stuff I give you thumbs up fly color so let's uh, let's proceed guys thank you for watching uh, i'll be updating you guys soon uh, about the products the two products uh, one is the cse and the other is the charger so stay tuned and 
check the description for the links you can find more detail details things about this e this products on fpvcrazy.net so stay tuned guys thank you for watching